everyone, this is Alan from BMW Durham back again with another video. We have another new arrival. It's a 2024 BMW M2 from Brooklyn Gray Metallic. All right, so this is the 2024 BMW M2 in Brooklyn Gray Metallic. This is not only our first 2024, but also uh, the first one that I've seen in person in Brooklyn Gray, and the Brooklyn Gray paint actually looks really good on the M car. I think it really uh, shows off the lines really well and this being the only gray slash silver type color that it's currently available on this car uh, I think it's actually a really good choice now I'm just gonna do one full lap all the way around the vehicle so you can get a good chance to see how that paint looks in the Sun we've been having a uh, very mild September it's actually really hot outside today <laughs> but uh, overall this car looks really awesome and definitely wanted to share it with you because again first Brooklyn Gray and 2024 G87 to come to BMW Durham let's take a look at the details Brooklyn Gate Gray Power Dome look at that right down into the Rondell <clears throat> horizontal kidney there M2 badging on the kidney nice big square openings squared off headlights we've got the individual shadow line adaptive LEDs here which look really good and overall I think the front end of this car is looking really really nice um, I think it's starting to really grow on people especially in the mod community once they've seen it slammed with T's <laughs> so here we have 19 inch front 20 inch rear uh, 930M wheels in black with the blue M compound brake so that is looking really sharp I uh, really like how this looks on here and we've got 275s on the front and on the back we've got 285s so there it is that looks really nice now just looking at the side profile of the vehicle with the gray color you can really see the lines here coming straight out I think that looks really good body colored side mirror and it is the uh, M wing mirror We've got black window surrounds carbon fiber roof over here and look at that they paint the antenna black new style antenna by the way and uh, come around the back look at that massive rear quarter sticking out so we've got uh, G body 2 series tail lights on there we have body colored spoiler Brooklyn Gray M2 badging on the rear here and we've got those vertical reflectors and we've got of course the quad exhaust down here as well looking really nice and when we come around this way sorry about my shadow we're looking for 93 octane shell V power and if we open up that door here it's the touch comfort access inside so we do have the M carbon bucket seats in black merino leather with the M highlighter colors here as well so that looks really awesome I love these seats um, I'd say you know what once you get in them they're actually way more comfortable than you think you've got the aluminum M2 door sill down there we've got M illuminated highlighters we have Harman Kardon got uh, carbon fiber on the dash here that looks really good I drive 8 not 8.5 for 2024 we have wireless charger we have USB we have cup holders 12 volt plug we've got the M shifter more carbon fiber red push start button to open that up USB type C is inside of there and uh, let's just look inside the glove box just for fun yep now if I open this up here, so if I pull the string, put it into the acute angle, not only do we get a chance to see that lovely carbon fiber on the back of the seat, but we can see back here, so these are the black Renosca leather seats in the rear, and the two headrests are up, there's a uh, pass through through the center, no armrest, and a little storage area down here. Back of the center console, we just have vents now, there's no climate controls whatsoever, and we've also got some ducts there for your rear passenger's feet 
There is also, of course, a coat hanger on the back of each B-pillar, and we've got some reading lights up top. And these headrests can also flip down if you don't want them up like this. And then once I put the seat back into the recline angle, it will go back to the previous position it's in. Let's go open the door on the other side. All right, so if we approach from the driver's side, let me just open up that door here. Again, we've got the illuminated M highlighter colors there, which is awesome. Memory seats, side mirror controls, window controls, trunk release down here. M2 door sill take a look at these beautiful seats right from the carbon fiber in the crotch all the way up illuminated M2 badging on the headrests and of course this piece can be removed to make space for your helmet in here we've got head up display I drive 8 and look at that beautiful carbon fiber all on the steering wheel we've got the carbon fiber uh, shift paddles the red M1, M2 config buttons there. And down here, let me pull this twice. One, two. So because we pulled it twice, we don't have to find anything here. We just simply lift this up, reveal S58 three liter inline six twin turbo. We have 453 horsepower, 406 foot pounds of torque. What an absolute beast, and I love that black triangular strut brace under here. We have positive battery terminal here, we've got negative battery terminal, and we've got washer fluid. What an absolute beast this is. New M2 is amazing. Alright, so before we conclude the video, I'm going to do one more big lap all the way around the car so you can see all the angles from a little bit of a more zoomed out view. profile on this side is incredible I love how boxy those fenders are and uh, I, I think everyone who's now seen this car in person can agree uh, this vehicle does hold a lot of the old-school BMW DNA even though it's come in a more modern package but I mean front engine rear wheel drive inline six available in manual this is an M car. All right, so that was a little exhaust test there. We had it in M2 config, which we had everything on Sport Plus. What did you guys think? I actually personally think the M2 exhaust sounds better than the M3, M4. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. Alright everyone, so that was my tour of this beautiful 2024 BMW M2 in Brooklyn Grey Metallic. Let me know in the comments below what you think of this spec and what do you think about this car in Brooklyn Grey. And uh, we've got the pricing information in the description as well. If you like the video, if you like the car, if you like me, make sure you like, share and subscribe. Uh, please give me a five-star Google review on our BMW Durham Google page. It really helps me out. We'll see you on the next video. Thank you so much for watching.